What's up everyone? So I just got back from the comic shop. I had to make a few trips because they hadn't uh, updated their uh, independence until like later in the day. So I, uh, I had to come back. Um, wasn't very impressed by that, but whatever. Anyhow, it's new comic book day. Uh, so I um, thought I'd give you all an update on what I bought. So of course, this is the free preview thing. This is Marvel's free preview thing. Um, this is uh, DC Connect. This is their, you know, the Marvel one's thicker. I don't know. DC's slacking. Uh, better shape up. So uh, my DCs. So I got, uh, I got Batman. I'm getting back into Batman. Uh, I, I should. I mean, I've been neglecting Batman uh, over Superman and other things. So uh, I know that um, Batman comics, especially Detective comics, which this isn't, um, are really good right now. I know uh, my buddy J Man keeps. Uh, keeps telling that but um yes so batman i got the new shazam um new champion of shazam she's got the power so i'll, I'll take a look at that man I, I am a sucker for any shazam thing dark crisis number three of seven um the most who cares event in the history of who cares events uh the battle of the emerald army sure whatever i'll i'll take a look at that Here's Godzilla Rivals versus Batra. Uh, that's pretty cool. Um, you know, I'll, I'll give it a go. I think this is uh, some sort of like, it's cover B. I couldn't find any other other covers for it. I just saw this and I was like, oh shoot, I'll, I'll snap it up. That's nice and thick too. Um, Red Man uh, uh, issue two. I had uh, uh, bought issue one. I enjoyed it. A um, little low on on um, on dialogue, but that's okay. Um, looks very much like the old show. Uh, but um, but of course with new art and everything, um, pretty cool. So yeah, I'll I'll, um, I'll check out issue two. Um, here's Spawn three thirty two. Um, you know I'll check it out. I, I I like what I'm reading from Spawn right now. Um, and it's funny because a lot of it is uh, nostalgic for me. It's like they, all these old characters are you know they're doing new things and stuff like three hundred something issues later, uh, like Overt Kill and. And all that good stuff. So, um, so yeah, check it out. Uh, here's a GI Joe uh, Best of Snake Eyes one shot. This is Larry Hammer up top. I like these uh, IDW GI Joe one shots. Um, they they put in a lot of good like old comics and stuff like that. I I, I thought I'd check it out. Whatever. This is from a few weeks ago. And uh, previews. Um, I love looking through these. It's, it's like it's like um. Adult Collector um, uh, Sears Wish Book or Consumer's Wish Book if you live in Canada. Um, it's like big and thick and like it, it doesn't cost that much. Um, and all sorts of uh, great stuff coming down the pipe, you know, and you get to read it, see what's, what's going on and stuff. So, And arguably the most exciting thing I picked up this week are old... Um, back issues of back issue magazine how meta is that um i saw these are like four of them uh and they're they're fairly cheap so i i i, I nabbed them i i uh, snapped them up let me move this because it's pretty big um so yes uh i i love these um magazines about comics i love anything like any colorful magazine about hobbies and stuff like like toys etc um and I don't really actually see back issue around much um, at comic stores and stuff. Just occasionally I'll see it. It's the same thing with Kirby Collector. Like, I know they still make them, but, like, sometimes I'll see it. And I don't know if it just gets rotated around in distribution. Like, some issues get get um, distributed to certain stores and some don't. I don't know what's going on there. Um, but this is cool. This is Hawkman in the Bronze Age is the big feature. Um, so also, it's a, a bird... Um, um, bird oriented uh, superhero issue um, like Hawk World and Hawk and Dove and everything is talked about here um, lots of good stuff about all the bird related characters there's Hawk World there um, and also just Hawkman in the Bronze Age uh, which is neat and there's the superpowers figure that was uh, I got him and Superman in, in one Christmas They're great that super that, that Hawkman comic was awesome um, so yeah, that's cool. I'm looking forward to uh, looking at that. Uh, here's a back issue for, I guess, um, uh, like October, like a Halloween time. It's an all-monster issue. 
And here's like Superman's scariest battles with monsters and also like Batman in the horror genre, uh, Marvel Scream Up, uh, Dracula and uh, and um, Godzilla versus Marvel. Yeah, so all the appearances they made and all sorts of other great cool stuff. Um, really awesome. I'm looking forward to, to going through all the Doctor Strange, um, anything horror oriented and monster oriented. Uh, Champions was in there for some reason. Um, here's another back issue of back issue. Uh, Bronze Age promos, ads, and gimmicks, which is cool stuff. Uh, uh, of course, um, the Hostess Pie ads are in there. Let me move this out of the way. Um, that's neat. And also, like, all the promos they used to have, like, uh, like mail-away things, uh, clubs, stuff like that. Um, lots of great... I love these things because they're like a good visual guide for stuff. A quiz that used to get mailed out and stuff. DC Superstar Society. Um, TV comic books. Uh, what's this? Oh, cool, man. Hostess comic ads. Checklist. See, I love these magazines that have these guides and lists and stuff. It's great. Um, and last but not least, another uh, back here. This is uh, Supergirl in the Bronze Age. Um, and also there's other stuff too about like pre-crisis uh supergirl death of supergirl uh the supergirl movie etc etc uh great little magazine that has all all this visual guide stuff about all that stuff here's yeah the the whole everyone imitating that that magazine there that um sorry that cover oh let me get to it man there it is look at all these uh imitators <laughs> of that crisis uh cover um who is Superwoman? That's cool, you know. Um, it's funny because I bought these new comics, and the most the, the the thing I'm most excited to to look through are these old issues of of back issue. They're really from like the la the past like uh, two to four or five years. Uh, but I just I, I I love it. Like I'm probably gonna dive into these first before I I uh, read the new comics and stuff, and you know like plug my nose and read Dark Crisis. Um, it's just exciting and cool stuff. So I, I don't know what that says about me or the comics industry, but there you go. Anyways, that's what I got this week.